Hello students. Today we are going to prepare thalic anhydride from thalic acid. Before we start experiment, let us discuss in short uh, about reaction of this uh, preparation. This is organic preparation. Uh, thalic acid, it is dicarboxylic acid, contains two carboxyl groups which are adjacent to each other on dehydration. When we heat thalic acid, it undergoes dehydration reaction, uh, gives water molecule and uh, cyclic anhydride is formed which is stable. Um, let us see apparatus. Uh, we require porcelain dish, then glass funnel, then filter paper, tripod stand, wire gauze, burner for heating, and chemical required is thalic acid. So let us start with the experiment. Uh, we have to take exactly, we have to weigh 2 gram of thalic acid on electronic balance. So this is 2 gram of thalic acid. We have to weigh this thalic acid on rough paper. Then transfer thalic acid in clean and dry porcelain dish. If it is not dry, then make it dry using filter paper. And then transfer this 2 gram of thalic acid carefully in porcelain dish. Now we have to cover this porcelain dish with filter paper, but this filter paper, uh, we have to make number of holes in the center part of this filter paper. So for that, take filter paper and then place this glass funnel on filter paper and with the using pencil or pen, draw circle like this. So, we have drawn circle using funnel. Now in this circular portion, we have to make number of holes, uh, not too large, using pen, like this. So in this whole region, we have to make fine holes. One filter paper is ready. Filter paper is ready. Now this is filter paper. It is like sieve. It's having number of holes at the center. Now cover this porcelain dish uh, in which we have taken thalic acid with this filter paper properly and remove these ends because when we heat we have to remove these ends of the filter paper This is porcelain dish it is covered with this filter paper. Now place this porcelain dish along with filter paper on tripod stand using wire gauze. Now we have to place glass funnel on this porcelain dish. Uh, which is covering uh, filter paper covered with filter paper. So uh, before we place uh, glass funnel, you have to seal the stem of glass with piece of cotton. 
gently so take a piece of cotton and insert this gently in stem of glass funnel so like this the stem is uh, stem of glass funnel sealed glass funnel should be clean and dry also now glass funnel you have to place carefully on this porcelain dish covering filter paper now before we start uh, heating we have to make the flame low and blue flame is required because for this experiment slow heating is required so put on the body so this is low flame now let us start heating porcelain dish containing polyester so on after heating thalic acid uh, dehydration takes place and water molecules form due to uh, loss of water molecules this filter paper become moist after some time and then Now the vapors of thalic anhydride pass through the holes of filter paper, and when these holes come in contact with the inner surface of glass funnel, the vapors gets converted into solid crystal. So this is sublimation type of reaction also. So we have to heat slowly at least ten to fifteen minutes, and then we are going to uh, see the. fine crystals are formed here are fine needle shaped crystal you can see inside funnel and filter paper become moist due to uh, loss of water we have to continue heat heating this uh, till this filter paper will become again uh, will dry again and you will get maximum crystal you can see maximum crystals are formed so these are vapors of salt thalic anhydride needle shaped crystals now you are able to see fine needle shaped crystals are forming now you can see filter paper uh, become dry again now we have to stop heating so put off the burner now let it cool down for at least 10 minutes because slow cooling is also required for this uh, crystal formation so we'll see after 10 minutes uh, maximum crystals maximum vapors gets converted into crystals and sufficient quantity of crystal will form inside funnel so slow cooling is important now you can see the maximum vapors gets converted into solid crystal now remove funnel 
carefully. And remove all the crystals from funnel. And you have to collect these crystals on aluminium foil so that the crystal will not uh, stick on. on uh, so if you take on, if you uh, transfer the crystal on rough paper, the crystal will stick with this uh, rough paper. So instead of rough paper, we will using aluminium foil. So remove all these crystals carefully. Filter paper also across crystals and filter paper. So remove, remove these all these crystals and collect on paper. These are the crystals having in the Now transfer. Yeah, we have to weigh these crystals on electronic balance. For that, uh, make paper board of aluminum foil like this. And then place it on electronic balance. This is weight of it is already weight is uh, this is weight of aluminum foil and now make it zero so that weight of aluminum foil subtracted. Now transfer thalic anhydride crystal carefully in aluminum foil paper. And then note down the weight of thalumine, uh, al thalic anhydride to calculate practical yield.